Davis Webb is faster to the film room than New York Giants starting quarterback Eli Manning and two-time Super Bowl MVP has a theory on how he does it. I like Davis, H.E.S. a good kid and we get along well, Manning said of the second-year quarterback in an exclusive interview with Steiner Sports. He works extremely hard. He loves watching film and looking at the mechanics. H.E.'s kind of stolen my chair in the film room. I usually always go in there after practice and watch the film. Now, every time I go in there, I don't think he showers. H.E.S. already always in there. He works extremely hard so I appreciate that and the work ethic that goes into it. Webb has followed Manning around since he first walked into the building and has based his own preparation around what H.E.S. observed. Webb began working individually with Manning again this offseason shortly after the Giants announced Shermer would be the new head coach. Per NFL rules, Webb and Manning couldn't work with Shermer and get a head start on his new offensive scheme, but they used the time wisely anyway. Manning and Webb trained together, they ate together, and they watched game tape of Shermer's offensive scheme with the Minnesota Vikings during the 2017. Manning and Webb got to work all the way back in January. It's been really great, Webb told reporters in minicamp when discussing his training with Manning this offseason, via Big Blue Interactive. Me and him Manning had a pretty good system in January, February and March, just kind of working out every day together, lifting and running. And just kind of watching a little Minnesota stuff here and there and just kind of getting the conceptual mindset of what's to come. And it's really helped us the past couple of days. The Giants off-season training activities will shortly be underway with the 2018 rookie class. Take a second to sign up for our free Giants newsletter. Webb played in an offset of the air raid offensive scheme at Cal. This offensive scheme draws next to no similarities to the NFL scheme installed by ex-head coach Ben McAdoo and new head coach Pat Shermer. Manning said HES happy to be helping Webb pick up the blitz protections and unfamiliar play calls, and in turn, this exercise is actually helping the veteran quarterback. The offense features some spread concepts Shermer learned during his time working with Chip Kelly that derive from the college game. Webb is actually helping Manning learn these. There are certain things that you're doing, maybe plays that he ran in college that I've never done before, so we'll ask him how they did this and how they read this, Manning said. There's a lot I've been through over the years. The second year learning a new playbook for him is different for me. Some plays, I've run before in the old offense. Some protections HES never had and I've had. So I can help him by just kind of talking those things through, helping him how to make quick decisions on protections and calls. This is not the first time Manning has admitted that working with Webb has also helped to him improve. Earlier this offseason, Manning talked about how their consistent work together breaking down game tape in the film room has helped to him get faster acclimated to Shermer's new offensive scheme. Most of the highest stakes professional poker players talk about how important it is for their process to include constant conversations about past hands and strategy with other professional poker players. This concept is similar for quarterbacks in an NFL era that accentuates the importance of short and intermediate accuracy, mental processing both pre- and post-snaps, decision-making, and anticipation throwing. Reed, Eli Manning talks about the benefits of working with a quarterback like Davis Webb. Webb earned Manning's respect early on during his rookie and that's why the two have built such a strong relationship during their first 12 months together as teammates. I think I got his respect early on last year, kind of doing so much stuff for him week to week, scheming defense-wise, Webb said back at the voluntary minicamp. Now, we're on the same level. When I got here a year ago, Eli was, I think, year four in the system. So, he was at like Algebra 20 and I was in addition. So, I kind of caught up a little bit towards the end of the, not near his level, obviously. But now, we're kind of starting off in addition and now we're moving on to Algebra 1. So, we're getting there, we're kind of learning together and it's been a lot of fun learning with him and HES got a lot of experience. Photo, Noah K. Murray, USA Today Sports, Reed, Trent Dilfer, the Giants already have their future in Davis Webb, Manning is simply happy to be involved in a quarterback room that loves the excess and often little details that play such a key role in the game of football. Webb is never shy about picking Manning's brain and the veteran quarterback is happy to chop it up. I enjoy talking football, Manning said. I enjoy being in a quarterback room with a quarterback coach and offensive coordinator, and just talking concepts, talking football, how to pick up this protection or blitz. 
H. He's eager to learn those things and ask a lot of questions and am willing to talk a lot about it and kind of be that teacher. It helps me remind myself how to do things and prepares me for it as well. Earlier this week, safety Landon Collins made it clear that he believes Webb is the future of the Giants' quarterback position and the future face of the franchise. General Manager Dave Gettleman also heaped praise on Webb based on the major progress he has made from 2017 and what he showed during the team's three-day minicamp. Both Gettleman and Shermer are equally as excited about getting fourth-round rookie quarterback Kyle Lawletter into the mix. Shermer made it clear his goal is to build a competitive, talented, and smart quarterback room with the ultimate goal of building a quarterback culture with the Giants. Manning, Webb, and Lawletter will help make up the new-age Giants quarterback room with the intention of fitting Shermer's vision.